Look, uh, 448 uh, kilograms of methamphetamine, that's, uh, that's huge, that's uh, significant. Uh, it's probably um, uh, a third of that amount has been found uh, previously uh, as a total um, in one seizure. Uh, and it's probably more than double uh, any other year uh, so far that's been seized, so it is significant. So uh, really the, t the timeline relates to the information that's coming in from the public. That's one of the uh, best parts of, uh, of what has occurred and, and eventuated. Uh, the public's been feeding us little bits of information around uh, people trying to launch boats uh, on 90 Mile Beach uh, and some of the behaviours around the camper van in the Prado uh, have, have added up to us uh, finding a boat and, and a boat being reported abandoned on the beach and that's what's led uh, to this event. So whilst we were at the uh, boat having a look at uh, what was left uh, on the boat, uh, the Prado actually uh, went by, uh, so we uh, stopped that uh, vehicle obviously, and uh, from, that, uh, from that incident we arrested uh, two of the people. It was later uh, that evening actually when the uh, young uh, copper uh, did some brilliant bit of work. Uh, he, he'd knocked off, he'd finished for the day, uh, he was going home, and uh, he saw a uh, camper van, um, he did a bit of uh, looking around and decided that may be our uh, vehicle. Called in some help, they stopped that vehicle and uh, of course now it's history, they found the first, uh, first bag that contained sort of 20 to 30 kilos of methamphetamine and uh, thought they were on a winner then and then they found the other 14 bags. Well, I think there was a fair level of excitement uh, that they, uh, you know, they really did uh, know that they'd come up, uh, come up with something and I think something akin to hoopering and a hollering uh, might have happened for a short period of time, but they're professionals, so uh, they dealt with it. It's, it's uh, not likely to happen again in a hurry, I wouldn't think, that uh, sort of amount. That, that is a huge amount uh, of methamphetamine. It doesn't fit in your average SUV. Uh, yeah, no, it's, uh, it's a pretty exciting uh, find. Are there any leads as to who might be involved? Uh, that's uh, part of the investigation that's going on with, uh, uh, between Customs and the police. It's a joint investigation uh, now. So uh, what I would say though, with this amount uh, of uh, methamphetamine, it's got to be uh, organised crime uh, is here and that, that's probably quite obvious. Um, so that's as far as I could take that.